Yes, lads, welcome back to another training video. So, it's rewards day today. Uh, I've sold two things. I think that was from, um, yeah, a shadow and a bar unit pair, which I picked up for three, five. So, I'm for four, three. And a shadow card. I think I've got an SBC pack or something. Um, and then we've got our rewards. I'm not going to get anything in my rewards. I'm just going to show you anyway, but. Um, this is not a rewards video. I just thought, you know, I'll show you. I got like nine wins this weekend. It was absolutely atrocious. Worst I've ever done. Um, here you go. So, whatever that can be. Do you know what? It's not the worst, actually, is it? 83. I I think that's the highest rate of play I've even packed this year. So, yeah, that's all right. Um, and then we've got <coughs> uh, the rivals, right? Which we've got ranked two in, I think. Um, let's have a look. Yeah, we'll go with this. I mean, <coughs> we could go 39k, but what's the point? Um, <coughs> so we've got a really bad throw still. We are going to go tradable though. Yeah, oh, pardon me. Right, let's do this. A walkout would be nice. Even a few boards would be nice, to be fair. But um, let's have a look what we get. Turn the TV down, it's a bit loud. No, that's nothing. It's always nothing, man. It's always nothing. Yes, 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 yes. Put out a trade pile just in case. Rare gold pack, a mega and a rare electrum. I mean, they've got some chances to get something good here. Let's have a look. That looks. Is that something? Oh, it's a board. Is, is it an inform? Oh no, it's not. Sorry. 85 rated. That's not bad. I'll take that. I'll take that all day. Um, yep. Just make sure my mic's going because sometimes it can scat out. Um, do you know what? I'm going to keep him anyway. So I'm going to try and do this icon SPC before it disappears. Um, I at least want to do one, but I kind of want to like do them for free. So I'm going to try and do the. Um, the SBC, you know, the 81 to 87 pack. Try and do them. See so if I can get a few 86s, a couple of 87s. Try and make it as cheap as possible. What is... I think this is a board again. Argentina. Striker. Higuain. Not bad again. I'll take that. 85. To be fair, I'm actually quite happy with these rewards. Oh, swig of the old coffee. Um... So look if anything's, you know, anchor was nice actually. We could do it with an anchor. Bang, two thousand coins, three days. Get rid. Not bad, not bad. We're over a mil now. Um, we're up. To, I think if we can sell, I think if we can sell our De Bruyne and our Mertens for profit, we'll be about one seven. So we're hoping for that today. We're hoping for them to bounce up. Come on. Let's have a walkout. Oh no. Oh, hello. Oh yeah, walkout. Serbia. Okay, I mean it's an inform. It's an 84 inform actually. Do you know These rewards have been really good. Yeah, I'm happy with them. I should have took untradeable though, thinking about it, because they're only going to go in the Icon SPC, and that's a nice looking pack. Got some silvers there that could be worth something. I mean, yeah, look at this card. It's like 8k. We put them up for. You want to check your silvers as well, lads, because. You know, they can be worse. At, like, you would never know unless you look at like what he's worth. I mean, obviously, you can just go and look in the leagues, right? But. Let's have a look what Mikovic is worth. I mean, he's chilling at like. Probably 12k, 13k pickup. He's probably a good snipe, to be fair. Um, and then... Lee Sung, no, nothing. We're, we're throwing him in the uh, quick sale pile. Alright, lads, so... <coughs> <coughs> Pardon me, so... Let's get on with uh, some trading. Okay, boys, so... The market's not looking that busy at the moment. I don't know whether it's the time or not. I mean, it's, it's not even 12 o'clock yet, but... Whether people just, I mean, they just haven't got, you know, they've rinsed their club through these SBCs because 
I'm going to, six hours left, I'm going to cane this today, the 81 to 87. Um, I may do a video on that as well, and if we can get, you know, 86s and 87s in that, because I wanted to get this Icon SPC done. Um, that's probably the cheapest way to do it if you are doing this Icon SPC. Try and cane these, you only need six golds, and then you can just throw bronzes in, right? And if you've got the coins to do it, don't go out and buy bronze, just do the bronze method pack. Um, not only that, it works as well, because you can get squad fitness cards, things like that, and... Yeah, you can even get players that are worth three, four hundred coins. So I would do that. Um, so if you've got like low, low coins, you know, even like twenty thousand coins to, you know, or even under ten thousand coins, uh, there's a few trading methods you can do, right? So um, you don't really want to be investing in in cards for ten k because it's just pointless, right? You can't you can't pick up many cards and. You're not going to make that much back, so you just want to kind of make your coins as you're going along. I've just done the wrong thing. Yeah, make your cards as you're going along. So if we go to Bundesliga and go to Bayern Munich, <coughs> got a bad throat. The cheapest card on here was one five. Now it wasn't one five; it's about one seven. Um, it just means the market is kind of picking up. Go back to 1 1, right? Try and snipe one for 1 1. Probably won't be able to get one now, but if you're sniping one at 1 1, you're selling them for 1 5. 50. We're going to have 55 coins tax or something. You're looking at easily 350 coins a card, right? If you can pick up, what, 3 of these in a minute or two when the market's busy, it's 1,000 coins, just like that. It's 1,000 coins up, right? Um, it's very simple. Trading's very simple. Once you once you work out the tax and you work out, you know what you can do. I mean, you could some some could even pop up for eight fifty. I'm just going one. I mean, we could go one two, right? We ain't got to be that greedy. But the thing is, the market isn't that busy. So they're not popping up. Um, or you know, go go and bid on them. Go one two and uh and go and bid on them. Yeah, I'll take you for one two. I'll take that for one two. Um, we're we'll add to him because I'm not sure what he's going for, but you can just mass bid, right? Until you run out of coins, or you know, mass bid half of your coins and then you know, try and trade with the other half. But don't go all out um, on mass bidding because you'll probably miss a lot of opportunities like this. Come on, where are you? Let's have a look what they're up to now because they were 1 7 about 10 minutes ago. Yeah, there you go, look. So it's kind of picking up slowly. Um, it's one five. Has he been sold yet? No, one five. He's still there. Probably because he's bronze and you need like a seventy nine red card. But this is a good trading method. I don't know why I haven't picked any up. I really don't. It's a bit weird and it kind of makes it look like it's bad. But honestly, it's not. That's that's one trading method you can use anyway. The second one is just to go across. I look at players like, for instance, Bai, right? Eric Bai. Um, it's like what? One, two, one, three. It's like what? One, four. So, let's say one, three. You better get rid of him for. Try and get one for a K. Just, just, just things that is or under a K. So we just go here and go to nine hundred. Go nine fifty. Alright, so someone's bidded that. And again, I think someone's literally just going to go across and, and and bid that on every single one. Yeah, right, okay, so he's kind of on Eric Bailly. There you go, boom. And then put him straight up for one free. I mean, this is minimum profit, right? This is like tedious profit, but if you've got just a little amount of coins... This is going to work 100%. You'll start building up a balance before you know it. Give it a couple of hours. You'll probably be about, what, 10, 10, 20k off more. And then you've probably got enough of the player you want. Or if not, and then you can move on to other trading methods that are going to get you, you know, get you more coins and things like that. But if you've got 10, 15k, you need to start off like this. There's no point trying to find that player that's going to give you a 5k boost straight away because it's unlikely. You can do. And there is um, trading methods for that. Like, um, let's have a look at Lucas, right? Uh, Lucas Mora. He was about 7'6 earlier when I was looking at him. And now he's going down, right? 
some five it's probably sold yeah there you go so it's sold I don't know why it's telling me it's there there you go boom 7k uh, we know it's definitely under 7k what's um, what it's like three three hundred and something kongs <coughs> tax something like that I think um, you basically three hundred fifty coins. What you what you basically do with five percent is you have you have the price so seven thousand to seven hundred. Then you just have the seven hundred right. It's three fifty. It's kind of how you work it out. With ten percent, you just take off the last zero, right? So you know ten percent of seven thousand six hundred seven hundred and sixty, right? You kind of get it. Um, so let's have a look at his prices. What seven eight? Yeah, you can sell him for seven eight seven seven. I'm gonna put mine up for seven eight. It's a striker. I think that's um, a position modifier, right? Um, buy hasn't sold yet. Trust me, buy will sell. Um, put him up for seven eight. He's got a chem style on him as well. I d I'm not sure what buy his price was, but. Oh yeah, it was one three, wasn't it? None up for one three. But here you go, look, you got bought for one point three. Um Paris has just got to be more than that, right? It has to be more than that, he's an eighty four. If not, and then I'm gonna keep him and put him into the SBC, but let's quickly have a look at Paris Yeah, he's a hundred percent more than that. What is he like? Four nine, four eight? This kid nearly got him for that as well. Let's see, it's a first turn as well, so. Keep an eye on him. We'll try and get. See what his absolute lowest is. 5k, right? 5k. Probably get him. Probably get rid of him for 4.9 straight off. <coughs> Let's have a look. The thing is, that I don't think people are interested in um, buying teams at the moment. I really don't, because. I think they're waiting for the promo to come out. I keep, I keep burping. Apologise. Yeah, I think they're waiting for the promo to um come out. Let's have a look. Come on, we're gonna get them for this. I shouldn't have went that high to be honest with you. Yeah. This is gonna be alright. This is gonna be about what two hundred and fifty coins. Uh, it's going to be like 350 coins profit, maybe 400 coins profit. It's not the best, but do you know what? With that, Lucas and Bay were over a K profit already, and it's been a couple of minutes, so. Do you know what? Oh, God, what was his price? I'm going to have to go and have a look, because I don't want to put him up for something that he's not. And his price could be changing quite dramatic, dramatically as well. Let's have a look. Yeah, he's four, I thought it was 4.9, right? Yeah, 4.9. So we'll put him up for that. Bar Munich player is quite good to do. I haven't looked at any of the other SPCs. There you go. Buy you sold. Happy days, right? Lucas Moore will sell. It's only a matter of time. Uh, <coughs> again, it's not the best profit. <coughs> Bloody hell. It's not the best profit, but this kind of profit you make when you're, you know, under 10k things like that just this is why I'm kind of doing this um who else could we look at for instance like because it's okay right I mean this guy gets packed all the time but he kind of keeps at a price so five to it was about five five last night four nines have a look I mean you probably could have got that Five one, yeah, yeah, definitely go for five one. So try and go for like four six or something. Let's have a look. As well, SPC players. Any any players used for SPCs, try and pick them up. Go on foot being on SPCs. Look at expensive teams, right? And then on there, they just show their price. Try and pick them up. Some like seventy nine red cards are like four k. You know, and people don't realize that. People just throw them up for a k or whatever or. Minimum price, you get yourself a bargain. There you go. <coughs> Didn't take too long, did it? I apologise for my cough. It's um, it's annoying me. So, apologise for that. It's five k. So, kind of making a bit of profit there. 
um, even if you bid, like, you know, bidding this year is, um, it's better than ever. I'd go, let's go 4 6. I mean, alright, someone, someone's kind of doing that already. Um, don't even waste your time, man. They, they know kind of what the minimum is to make coins on. I mean, 4 6. They're probably making like a hundred and something coins a card, right? And, you know, his card could even go down from that. Time he's got the players, his card could go down, so. Be careful on that. But, yeah, and then the other way to um, make coins is go to about 4k. If you've got 10k or 15k, then go to the max on that, wherever it is, and go across. If you see a bid, search him up, see what he's going for. Let's have a look. I mean, we're probably ain't going to see anyone now, right? That's the thing with, like, guys, you've got to know what they're going for. Okay, now, so as you can see, the four players we've picked up, what well, wasn't even 10 minutes, right? Uh, we've already sold them all. Do you know what I mean? Probably just under 2k profit, something like that. That's not the end of the world. It's not, it's not the best, but you know, it's 2k up. I'm, I am 2k up, so it's not the best or anything like that, but, you know, it helps out, it helps out. Um, you know, we're looking at a hauler there, for instance. He's what? 2-7? Try and get them for like two three. They'll probably pop up for two three throughout the day. Wait till the market's busy and um and snipe them up. But just look at players that are if you've got low budget, obviously the title on this is gonna be low budget, so I'm guessing majority of you guys, you know, you've got low budget, but even just stick to leagues, man, just stick to, you know, go to that five K max. And you know, and, and just go across and just see, you know, who's good, who's not. <coughs> like um, Ake for instance, right? What's Ake going for nowadays? Definitely not one two, but he's probably going for about what nine fifty. There you go. I mean, pretty pointless that was, but I didn't lose out on him. It gets sold for that as well. Um. Thousand coins. I could have put that for a thousand coins. It's even more on. But as you see now, look, get a seven hundred. I just bid on him, man, because no one's really looking at players like this. I know I can send for a thousand, but if you do get loads of these, don't um put them all up for a thousand coins. You know, put one or two up, let them sell. One or two, let them sell. One or two, let them sell. But well, even if, like, you know, we're selling this card at 900 coins, easy profit, easy profit. Ah, uh, we missed out on that one, that would have been nice. You know, and then, like I said, if you're... Yeah, like I said, you know, if you invest in half of your coins into, you know, bidding on players and the rest of trying to snipe, do that. But it is quite simple, lads. Let me know anyway what kind of coins you're on. Um, kind of what trading methods you want to use. You know, if you if you've got like coins like me, a million, and you know, good players to trade with and things like that. Just let me know down below, and um, I'll do a video on it. But that's gonna be it for the video, guys. Until then, peace.